prolonging the military rule in Mindanao for another year may not be needed as there is no more actual rebellion to suppress by the government, a respected lawyer here said Friday, December 15. Lawyer Eddie Quaresma said martial law may not be the solution to respond to potential threats to public security and safety since the president can, at any time, call out the armed forces to suppress threats. Martial law is not the only remedy. The president can call out the military, being the commander-in-chief, to repel potential threats. The president is not powerless, Quaresma said. Quaresma is the president of the Integrated Bar of the Philippines Misamis Oriental, IBP Misser, but clarified he is not speaking in behalf of the organization as the lawyers group has yet to issue an official statement on the matter. Quaresma said the IBP Misser supported the declaration of martial law after the extremist Mott ISIS terrorists laid siege in Marawi City as there was a clear basis to declare martial law. But this time, he said there has been questions on the constitutionality of the extension because there is no more actual rebellion or invasion. What's there to suppress when it was already suppressed, Quaresma asked. Kung Mazang at NISA Supreme Court Guapo NI na argument UG first time na mag ruling ang Supreme Court ani, it would be good if this goes to the Supreme Court as this would be a first, Quaresma added. The IBP Misser president said he is aware and understands that those who oppose martial law fear that human rights violations and abuses may escalate. He said the allegations of abuses such as looting allegedly perpetrated by government forces during the five-month-long fighting in Marawi should be investigated. He said the military and the police must assure the public that there will be no abuses in another year of military rule. He said should there be complaints and reports of violations of human rights, the IBP Misser is ready to give legal assistance and support to the victims. Meanwhile, Misamis Oriental Governor Yevgeny Mno said he will keep an eye and coordinate with the authorities to ensure the proper implementation of martial law for another year. Mno said the extension of martial law will help maintain peace and order as the government starts the rehabilitation and rebuilding of war-torn Marawi City. I feel safe in Misamis Oriental because the police is vigilant in conducting checkpoints and in advising the public against bad elements, MNO said. MNO said he is confident that the administration of President Rodrigo Duterte will not allow and tolerate abuses and violations of human rights while martial law is in effect.